know what you're about to do. Um, but <laughs> he's so dramatic. I know what you're about to do. It was a thumbs down for you. But I, I think I think on the album, it's it's going to be. I think it's going to work on the album. I still yeah. I still I still am holding out on that. I think it's going to flow well. I think there there are some R and B tracks that can lead in it to even take it to a different level. But um, what were your? Do you feel as though? Because it's so. I feel like Drake is Drake plays a different game. He's like anything I I drop is going to go one. But now I want to just hey, I'm going to give you the teaser. I said this is the old Drake. I want to make you make you know that it that it possibly could be the old Drake. W- what did you think about this? So we talked about this when we couldn't do the podcast. Yeah. Um, uh, you said it was going to place at number six on the album. I said number four. I think it's early, it's early, early in the album. Yeah. Um, but I do think this was a not a single song. This was a album song that, like you said, it will probably be you know, flow well within the album and give the, the album some context. But as an individual track, we talked about this. I thought SZA should have went first and then Drake could have came in with his his real trying. He get an E for effort because we haven't heard Drake really, really try to sing in a long time. Like he really tried Since to care sing. Package. Since Care Package. Yes, bro. Since Care Package. I Care Package, club, like... Days, well, hold up. Days in the East was on there. Club oh, Paradise, Care Package. yeah, Club, oh. yeah. Club, when he did that compilation, he, that wasn't compilation. Really, like, he, he was really like singing. He the moment. He did the moment. He was oh, even singing. You know what I mean? The moment. I, I love really like, the moment. Yeah, this is a great track. I ain't <laughs> really like singing, singing. <laughs> I get what you're saying. Though. I get what you're saying too, though. Like his that I don't think that's like really singing, singing. But he like really tried to be an R&B artist right there. There. Um, I just I just thought Scissor should have went first to set the tone. And I think her verse would have gave a, a different element of the track. And then you add the addition of Drake and then let yeah. him finish. I just thought I, like how, the, I, like, I really like how he I really like how he finished though. I think how he finished yeah. that was like it was that a was good dope. finish. That was it was a finish. good finish. But I think Scissors should have started. Maybe it would have been a different song. And we talked about this too, but by, by a lot of artists putting features first. Like I talked about Drake going first on Golden Roses. How about him going first on um No uh, Guidance? With, no guidance. It's yeah. a bunch of other artists. Kendrick Lamar going first on the. It's a bunch of other artists that it just gets you to set the tone because I didn't have any expectations for it, but as soon as he started like singing, singing, and I heard the mix and the master and how they try to tweak it as much as they could, and I was just like, okay, no, they. What did you think about first. the production? What did you think about the production on this? I thought it was impressive. The beat was dope, but I thought yeah. with his with his mastering, I thought it could it, they try as much as they always do with his with his vocals yeah. to try to like like really tighten it up tighten so it, it up. sounds yeah. so it sounds a certain type of way, but you can't negate that he really can't sing, and that's why I was like, <laughs> like he can hold a tune. Like I'm not taking like like I what you're uh, saying. Yeah. Ca- like doing him wrong. Oh yes. Like that's him really trying to sing, but it wasn't as like stressful as this track. Try you need to you the wrong thing to do. That's simple. That's not yeah, like going out so very simple. He was he was really trying to sing, bro. Like he like he drunk a lot of his whiskey and went it's into like, the studio. Uh, 40, 40, 40, 40, grab me the box. <laughs> oh Nico, 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 Nico. You know you gotta get What'd the low drink. <laughs> what do you think? You think I should really sing on it? He should have rapped on it. Chubbs, what, what's the Chubbs, word? Hey, what's the word? What's the, <laughs> <Uh-oh>. <laughs> what's the word? <laughs> but I... Can you hear me? Back. Okay, yeah. I'm back. Yeah, I think SZA should have went first. Um, hopefully, it gels well with the other albums. I'm not, I mean, other tracks on the album that it flows yeah. well. But we can wait. I was in a fan. Yeah, next week, next Wednesday. Yes, sir. That's a weird day to drop a. No, it's not. Is it Wednesday? Yeah, it's, I it's October six. Wednesday. <laughs> There's no way that's a- <laughs> Oh, I'm tripping. I'm tripping. I'm tripping. I was about to say that's a Friday. The Wednesday drop. <laughs> that's a Friday. All right, I'm tripping. <laughs> <laughs> Dropping it up. Oh, hump day. Okay. 